Hi everyone, my name is Justin Odisho and in this Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial I'm going to show you the basics of how to reverse a clip and also how to create a cool reverse stutter effect. So here's how the clip looks like in normal speed on the timeline, just basic walking forward. And in order to reverse any clip, you right click on it and then go to speed slash duration and you should see this little checkbox for you to be able to reverse the speed. But in this case, I'm going to duplicate my original clip so I'll keep the original speed clip, I'll paste this new clip, and then I'll right click and go to speed duration, and I'll reverse this clip. So this is what that looks like. We have our normal clip, and then our reverse clip, and it's seamless because where this one ends, the other one begins reversing. A quick tip is if you look at the actual clip information and name, you could see that this one's reversed because it says negative 100% which is the speed. So it should have a negative speed if it's reversed. So the basic clip reverse you can see is pretty simple, but I'm going to show you another quick technique you can use to create those cool reverse stutters that you might see sometimes. So find the spot where you want to create the stutter, so maybe like right here as the step lands, and then press C to go to your razor tool, and then hold shift and make a slice at that point. Now depending on how quick you want your stutter to be, move over a couple frames, maybe half a second, and then create another cut. So everything in between this section is what's gonna be repeated. So press V to go to your move tool and then make some space on the timeline so that you can duplicate this little clip two times. So a quick trick to duplicate things, if you hold Option or Alt on the keyboard and click and drag, you should see it'll make a duplication. Or you could just go the classic old school way, Command C, Command V, or right click, copy, right click, paste. So now that you have three duplications of the clip, you want to take the middle duplication and then right click and go to speed duration and reverse that middle clip. And that's what's going to create the stutter. Also remember if you have any sound or audio tracks that you want reversed to, you got to make sure those are highlighted. And let's play that back and see what that quick stutter looks like. So you can see it's a cool little stutter effect. And that's an effect that's definitely used a lot in combination with others to maybe syncopate things to the music or create another cool glitchy element to stylize your videos and projects. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick video on how to reverse a clip and some ideas on how to use it for effects. If you guys did like this video, definitely leave a like on it below and let me know what you thought in the comments. And check out my channel and subscribe to stay tuned for all types of new creative videos. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.